This movie describes the creation and editing of color tables in Teledyne PDS. Open the PDS Explorer. Open the Project Tab page. Right click on the color table node. Select New File from the context menu. Enter a name. Click on Save. The table generator opens. We will now demonstrate how to define a color table. For the hues colors. First we set our range to generate colors for. Click in the maximum range box. For example, we like to create a color table for heights with a maximum level of 10 meters. Enter therefore 10 as maximum range. Click in the minimum range box. And for example, we have a minimum range of minus 50 meters. Enter minus 50 as minimum range. It is possible to create a color table by the number of colors, or by the step size. Select, number of colors, and set the number of colors in the box. Set the color for the maximum range and minimum range. A color spectrum is generated between these colors. This will create in this example a color table of 256 colors in a range between 10 and minus 50. Press the replace button to generate the color table. For this example we have chosen the color red for the maximum range of 10, and the color blue for the minimum range of minus 50. 256 colors are generated. It is also possible to generate a color table by a certain step size. Select step size. Set the step size. For example 1. This means for each meter one color is generated. Set the color with the required minimum range, and the color with the required maximum range. Press the replace button to generate the color table. The color table is generated. A color table between a range of 10 and minus 50 with a step size of 1. When you click the down button the colors in the color table are shifted downwards. When you click the up button the colors of the color table are shifted upwards. Select this mode to use the whole color spectrum. In this example it means in total 62 colors are generated between the set maximum and minimum range. Select this mode. Then only the selected color for the minimum range and the color selected for the maximum range are used to generate a color table. In this example purple and red. When we select a different color. And press the replace button to generate a new color table. We have in this example. A color pattern between the color green and yellow generated. Press the grays button to generate a gray color table. A gray color table is generated for the defined minimum and maximum range. Press the rust button to generate a rust color table. A rust color table is generated for the defined range. Press the reverse button to reverse the colors for the defined range. The color for the maximum range is now brown and for the minimum range yellow. Let's now edit a color table in the grid model editor. Show the color table. Enable the interactive selection mode. We double clicked on the color table bar to open the color table generator. The name of the current selected color table is listed here. A different color table may be selected from the drop down list. Double click on a cell from the color table to edit this cell. In the open dialog we can change the color and the value. Change the color. Press OK. The color is changed.
Double click again on the cell. And change the value. For example into 5.5. Press OK. And the value has changed for this color. The same you can do by selecting the cell. Click on the cell. And press the edit button. We can change the value. And the color again. To add, in the existing color table, arrange with a smaller step size defined. We define, the range to add. Set the maximum range, for example 1. And set the minimum range, for example minus 1. Select step size to define a certain step size within this range. Set the step size, for example 25 cm. Press the add button. The range with the defined step size is now added to the range of the color table. In our example, a range of 1 to minus 1, with a step size of 25 cm is added. The color range of the color table can be changed as showed earlier in this movie. It is also possible to add a cell in the color table. Press on the add button and define the color and value for the new cell. For example a value of 4.5. And we select a color. The new cell is added in the color table. Select a cell and press the remove button to remove the cell from the color table. The cell is removed. Press the clear button to clear the whole color table. Press OK to save the color table. Press cancel to close the color table generator without saving the changes. The color table generator to generate color tables. Each data type have a color table. Color tables are selected from the coverage settings toolbar button. For example, if you click on the coverage settings toolbar button in the grid model editor, then you can select for each data type a color table. Open the drop down list to select a different color table. It is possible to select for each data type a different color table. 